Good evening, Bookman Beacons. This is Dr. Hill with this week's message from the helm. We've had another awesome week here at Bookman Road, and we are looking forward to a much-needed break coming up soon. We'd like to thank everyone who has participated uh, at least one day in our December to remember. These are just activities that we have planned just to give students something to look forward to each day as we are moving closer into the winter break. Today is Green Day, and tomorrow is You've Got Team Spirit. So with that, we're encouraging friends to uh, dress in a theme, perhaps with a friend or with others from the classroom, um, as a team in some way indicating that they are a part of a team. Uh, Again, these days are not meant to be stressful days. We try to create days that were um, easy, something very easy. As you can see, as I said, today is Grinch Day. <laughs> and so I decided to wear green, um, green that I already had, mind you, not to go out and, and purchase anything um, green. So um, with that, we are encouraging you to, as you're willing, as you're able, to allow your students to participate in some of the December to Remember days. We would like to congratulate our fifth grade students for graduating from D.A.R.E. The D.A.R.E. program focuses on making responsible decisions and being able to stand firmly against negative peer pressure. Our students went through several weeks of instruction from an SRO in our district, a school resource officer uh, Richland with the Richland County Sheriff's Department, a Deputy Hussein, and they completed an entire course. And so then again on Wednesday, they graduated. They graduated from DARE. And so we certainly want to congratulate uh, our students and our fifth grade teachers for a job well done during that process. We have much to celebrate. We focus intently on making sure that our beacons can light the way in personal character first, academics and community service. Uh, but again, as we are teaching them to light the way in personal character, we are trying to uh, model, demonstrate and encourage making the right decisions each and every day. So we thank you with your support. Thank you for your support with regard to that. Uh, again, as we are moving toward winter break, we're encouraging you to please have conversations with your beacons uh, about just making good decisions. We are seeing a couple of visitors here in the office um, who are just struggling, struggling with making good decisions. And of course, we're going to talk to them here on our end and uh, try to teach and encourage the skills needed. Um, but we're asking you to do the same thing each day before uh, your students head out the door, headed to school. If you would just give them a little pep talk and encourage them to demonstrate those qualities, those characteristics that you have taught them, then we will definitely echo those same sentiments on our end as we are continuing to develop our beacons. Thank you so much for your support thus far in the school year. We thank you for your words of encouragement. We thank you for your surcees. Uh, we've gotten some really cool um, surcees and encouraging uh, gifts, of course, not required. Um, but every word of encouragement is worth its weight um, in, in gold. <laughs> words of encouragement, weight in gold. Okay. Words may not weigh anything, but they weigh a lot on our hearts, the hearts of, and the minds of educators. So again, thank you so much for all that you do. In all things, remember we're beacons who light the way in personal character, academics, and community service. Have an amazing, amazing weekend. As a reminder, on our uh, early dismissal day, which is next Wednesday. Um, students will be dismissed at 11 o'clock a.m. There will be no breakers after school program. That's very important. No breakers after school program. So please make sure that your students have transportation here prior to 11 o'clock or that someone is there to meet them at the bus stop. Thank you so much again and have a wonderful, wonderful afternoon.